checking the stats every minute this week. I'm doing my part, I'm paying attention, and I play my position. It's the Crypto Lightsaber back with another video, guys. I'm going to talk about Pepe, specifically Pepe 2.0. This is a new version of the Pepe token. Okay, guys, not the same team or anything like that, but it has a very large community. And I've seen on Twitter that Pepe Army were actually supporting this project as well. So the whole concept behind this is um, Pepe, in fact, it says here, Pepe knows he made mistakes in the past, blacklisting some investors launching on a weekend when you're spending time with your family and friends he wants to make things right and redo his billion dollar run he has a new version of himself pepe 2.0 so pepe did blacklist a few wallets uh, i'm not sure what the whole story is or backstory is on that i'm sure it wasn't you know nefarious or anything like that but um you know ultimately decentralization when it when something is fully de or truly decentralized you're not going to have a blacklist function. You're not going to blast, blacklist wallets regardless if, if they sniped or whatever. Okay, guys. And Pepe 2.0 is basically just bringing back decentralization. So launching a new version of the token. Okay, guys. And, you know, the thing that caught my eye on this is the community. Okay. Not, not, not just the community, the price action as well. The price went absolutely crazy. Okay, guys. It went nuts. All right. It is on a pullback. Okay, so for me, I think this is probably uh, the best time to talk about it because it looks like it could be uh, buying opportunity where it is at the moment. Okay, guys. But um, yeah, I mean, it went on a huge run. The community is looking very bullish. It's hot number one on Dex Tools trending at the moment. Market cap is 13.67 million. It did go to about 50 million market cap. So this is the first major dip really on Pepe 2.0. Total market cap right now, again, 15.2 million with a nice, very nice liquidity. Of course, that is locked as well. And again, the community, right? So it's got 9,535 members. It seems like there's genuine members as well. Um, 1,448 online. This chat is absolutely nuts. Okay, guys. Um, a lot of times when the chat is going nuts like this, you could probably not even get much of a word in to say anything. It's just fun to see the green bubbles and kind of does something to your mind <laughs> the green bubbles watching all the buys come in okay guys but um yeah i think this one's pretty bullish and i thought i'd talk about it if we compare this with the uh the current price or market cap of pepe original pepe lg pepe that is currently sitting at 611 million right but that went to 1.6 billion so if pepe 2.0 can capture you know just a fraction of that market capitalization you know, this could take this to a very bullish. 10% will be 160 million. Okay, guys, if this went to 160 million from where it is right now, that is a little bit more than a 10x pump from here on this dip. So this could be a potential dip buying an opportunity. I'm not sure whether this could ever hit the 1.6 billion or, you know, even a billion. I don't know. But that is the aim for this project. That is what they're aiming for is to hit a billion market cap. We just don't know. It's speculative at the end of the day. It's very high risk. It's degen. Okay, guys, so um, obviously um, bear that in mind, but you're not buying the top, okay? So I'm not making a video telling you about buy the top or telling you about this project when it's at the top. I'm making it on the pullback, okay, guys? I actually bought it um, over here somewhere and I made um, I made some nice gains, okay, guys? But right now we're on a dip, so the dip, I have bought the dip, by the way, and, um, you know, I hope we can get a breakout. I hope we can see some more upside. Um, but yeah, there is some very bullish sentiment on this project. So, um, you know, we'll see how it goes. Volume as well has dropped. Okay, volume has dropped because we have hit the weekend. Yesterday was about 33, 34 million. So it's dropped by more than half at the moment. Okay, guys, but you know, it looks like the sellers are losing steam at the moment. So if we can start to get some momentum to the upside, that will probably get some nice follow through and we can see you know 100 to 200 percent pumps easily out of these types of tokens back to all-time high right now will be about let's just do a measured move from where we are right now back to all-time high is a 250 percent move so uh yeah let me know what you think in the comments guys pepe 2.0 does it stand a chance you let me know what you think. I'll leave the links in the description. That is the end of the video. Do me a favor and subscribe to the channel. Tick the little bell for notifications. And I will see you in the next video.